All right. Hey guys, what's up? It's Wolf here, one and only. How all my adventures are doing? Hopefully, you guys are doing well. Um, so, first things first, um, we are back on some more Gravitation memories. And they just released their new uh, table, which was actually, which is actually interesting. Because I do want to show it here. Um, where is it? I could just bring it up through. Which page was I on when I did this? Ah, oh, there it is. Lower that and display. Okay, yeah, this is their site. And yes, I've been through it. I say, I did want to give it a chance. I say, I'm already on my budget for this month anyway for my game. So I got a little bit extra saved up. So we're going to be trying out the new things that they just added. And just give you guys the, I guess, pretty much their Spender event. Their Spender event is actually pretty interesting because you can actually re -grow through it. I already have all these rewards and I can re -go through and get those rewards again, which is actually amazing because, like I said, their stuff is a lot cheaper than the official version. The official version would cost you, if I remember correctly, always like 200 to $300. And this would have only cost me like just 60 and a 40 so a hundred dollars that's it i say if i remember this was like the old old uh area game version though i say the official version doesn't have this spender vents anymore that is completely taken out of the official version but this private server has the spender events that everybody enjoyed and like to take advantage of and now they have a clay cell along with that so you can buy through multiple times and get multiple of these mounts, these clays, or these uh, this transformation that they just released. This, this, and GM titles. All of that you can go through and get. So I wanted to kind of uh, test some things out, just see the new things that they're you know messing with. They also have a first time spender. Reward 2, which is interesting. Oh, nice. Oh, you get one to uh, Santa mounts, the Christmas mounts exclusive. So, plus 10 is the highest that weapons can go at the moment. I don't have enough space. What do you. Oh. Duh, we got it's this. It really likes to be in here. Okay, that's not half bad for a spender event. Okay, and we got let's see. Yeah, quite a bit of clay for that. All of it is sellable. None of it is none of that non-sellable crap. Oh, but they did disappear when I uh, auto sort. Oh, there they are. They stacked. So I got nine hundred and twenty just for the hundred hundred dollars. That's a lot of clay. And in this economy, I haven't seen clay as trade so that's already a plus two you get this uh scorpion mount you can choose between what color you want on a site um you have this gm reward you have this costume reward i believe you use the gm or costume reward inside of their discord when they open up tickets uh, this is some VIP thing that you can open up. This is a gorilla form stone. That you can have up for 20, 20 minutes. Okay. Talents and some stones you can use. 
So you are unable to equip this item. So you can't equip these. So I think you actually have to go into the Discord and use these. Yeah, by Discord. All of those are by Discord. So these three items right here, you have to go into their Discord and, you know, put in what you want when the uh, tickets are open. So what's this? Okay, so this is a transformation that you can use. Uh, triple damage with bonus, well, with basic and abilities, 5%. Oh, and this is like a summon that fights with you. Yep. That's interesting. Hmm. I thought you could actually like transform into it. Unless I did it wrong. Oh, nope. So this is just a transformation. And this is... A summoning. Of something just to fight with you. Can I see what she does? No, I cannot. She has a lot of HP. Hopefully she's not one of those uh, pets that disappears when you try and use it. Well, when you're trying to fight. Hopefully she just doesn't die immediately. I mean, she's level 90. Which is pretty interesting. Oh yeah, then we have this, which is apparently equipment too. Which is called... Uh, Armor Breaker. How do I equip this? Unable to equip this item. Oh, this is a sprite thing. <laughs> Why am I trying to equip it? Maybe if you read the item, Wolf, you would actually know, stupid. So, this is a sprite thing. Let's see his face. I actually like that a lot. The little hat looks nice. <laughs> the only sad thing is, I don't think I can... Be in my transformations. Why that's also going on, right? I think it will take me out of it. Yeah. So it, it's it's a real downfall for Druid because it makes my forms like completely useless. Uh, where was um Echo? Wasn't it like Ancient Forest, right? No, it's not. Ah, yeah, it was ancient force. Let's go try some uh, things out. Uh, let's also look at the table, see what's going on here. So they do have a table. They have evasion and hit chance to abilities. They have the mystery boxes that you can grab. They also have the movements the movement uh nucleus so nothing too amazing in here not yet though I so said I think I'm gonna save I'm mostly curious to check these these uh items out in action
So let's see. If I hit. Yep, this is exactly what I thought. She hits for she hits for one damage, Sag. I like the animation sounds. <laughs> That was that was actually kind of funny. <laughs> hmm. I'm kind of sad she does no damage. So yeah, she's basically just a souvenir. Uh, that's pretty much all she is, really. Well then, uh, I'll keep that in mind. Oh yeah, I forgot about this. And equip and get some more HP out of. This was 20 minutes and more damage reduction. The only downfall of this transformation is the animation lock. The animation takes forever. So you can't efficient, efficiently like stun heal. It, like I said, is very useless for Druid. Oh yeah, she also does the two damage and um wakes them up. That's also another thing. She ruins the druid combo. You know, I don't think that would be bad if she actually did damage. <laughs> unforge, man, unforge. Now keep in mind to be careful of um any pets. The transformations are cool. The pet, not so much. I thought she was actually going to do damage. She looked cool. Guess you could just show her off for like bragging rights now. The reason I got the um, physical one is just because we're going to be going wolf form a lot. Once we get the chance. But like I said, it nah, this transformation isn't good for this character. Well, to this class. But you can archive it, which is nice. Um, let me go and wait, did I save my soul? Because we're gonna have to come back here. I mean, she's a good tank. She can't hold aggro worth the shit, though. <laughs> I kind of feel let down. But like I said, it is interesting now. It is interesting that they're adding things like this. And I'm pretty sure this character is from Roar Kingdom. Right? 
Just let me know if I am correct about that. It looks familiar like I've seen it in Warrior Kingdom. But um, anyway, we're supposed to be going to get a title as well. Oh, there it is. Perish. Yeah, let's see. Okay, so we got the Forgotten King title. So you could choose between one of those. The Forgotten T King title is basically the uh, Rogue Rogue Knight uh title. And I believe that's all the uh, all the stuff, right? I don't think there's anything else we need to look at or get. Yeah. All right. I say we could plus up our weapons, but um, hold up. God, you're covering the screen. Don't know about the unique sets though, but as I said, it's kind of still funny that they're using like <laughs> the league league icons. So I'm going to have to get my hands on this hammer. I'm not sure about that hammer. Probably that hammer and this staff, since this staff was going to help us a lot in late game. Just because the damage is lower. Because you can use that that uh, staff in wolf form too, to to get like yeah, to get reduced damage from uh, reflection damage. It's actually very useful. I actually want to see this mount too. My favorite color is green, so I have to get the green one. Actually, looks very nice. Actually, so we have ourselves a combat mount now. Question is, are all the animations faster? Yes, they are. So, scorpion mount. For the win, a new scorpion mount that is still pretty strong. Can't use it in dungeon though. Gotta remember that. Ah <laughs> oh, crap, that's what I forgot. Potions. Mana potions. Ah, there's no, uh, Kasumbu potions in here. I haven't really had the chance to explore their shop too much. Oh, there's this that I can grab. Ah, that's how you get the loyalty points. Through spending, you can go here and buy that. I think that's the only thing in there is that clay. So it's kind of like 
you buy stuff, we give back a little bit. That's that's pretty nice, actually. Uh, what else? Crazy thing is, we're not spending a lot, too. And we get that much back. It's pretty nuts. I'm expecting one of these Grand Fantasia's private servers to be able to buy gold and exchange gold for currency. I wouldn't put it past any of them to do that. Oh shit. Oh yeah, I forgot. This is this is a thing too now for them. So I can buy five of those. Yeah, think about this. Having this much versus like the official server is actually pretty nuts. Considering none of their stuff is like <laughs> none of their stuff is like putting a dent into this. I replace that now. Okay, yeah, I just had to get this stuff out of it. Like, <laughs> they even made more slots for these materials, which is like so freaking nice. Grand Fantasia doesn't, the official server doesn't have anything that goes up to 24 for like legendary bags, and I'm pretty sure they have higher ones than this, right? That's just very interesting to me. What is this one? Because some of these pills... Oh, yeah. What? They have higher pills. Just realize. Reduce farming. Reduce training. That's, I, I actually didn't see that until now. That's actually really good. Especially with their, their system they have already. Like if I just wanted to just push you back, then give you that, then just go tell you to gather a whole bunch of stuff. and instantly comes back. This is something I wish the official version had a little bit, but that I don't think that's ever going to happen. Also, uh, my gold, I also got to think about that right now my gold is gonna die extremely fast as I'm doing this so I should probably farm as I'm doing this <laughs> um okay we got quests so I do have to get rid of her or she's gonna keep waking up everything I say if Drew wasn't so heavily relying on um
on its stun. This wouldn't be much of an issue to have her out. So I say, it's not like we can command her to not attack. I think there were talk about reworks inside of their uh, Discord at one point, too. Now what? You're not in a good mood. Alright, there we go. Now, collect stuff for me. Wait, is my stuff not going off? Why are my heels not going off? Oh, they are. They're just delayed for some reason. I mean, it's fine if we die, but... Hold on, I, I definitely need to go get some potions. Druid is just way too mana hungry right now. So I'm curious, if they do do reworks, how are they gonna how are they gonna do it though? I had bought this so I can increase my weapon. Are those combined? Huh, interesting. Still don't know why that changed my name. So this is useful all the way up into level 60. 
the XP bonus for this is like pretty good, so I'm just gonna go ahead and get it all to to plus nine. Especially since round level six is where Druid actually starts to really shine. Well, as soon as you touch Mystic is where Druid starts to really shine. I guess I shouldn't use that right away, right? Oh, you bitch. Stop it. Cease. Cease your behavior. <laughs> Jerk, I'm over here trying to do stuff and you're interrupting. Ah, oh, that takes down that. Ugh. You douche. Spell casting lower. Actually, it's a half bad. I'll take that. But anywho, as I was doing before, I was so rudely interrupted. I say this dungeon, this dungeon rushing, should last up into. Roaring Mall, to be honest, for this gear. There's the five. Oh, whoops, wrong thing. So we're going to we're going to slowly see how how plus 9 gear goes in here. Like it, will it significantly lower everything or will it just, you know, kind of lower? I wouldn't expect like too much out of it. Because I don't think the HP and the MP actually goes up. I don't think it adds on like extra stats to. Let's say you at least give me my. My five, right? I'm not gonna lie, I do miss the whole the auto button for auto gear for auto upping your gear. But the number one thing I would like to see is the success rate. That's something I always like seeing in my games when I open gear. I want to see the success rate. I want to see how if it's fair, if it's how low it is, how low of a chance should I put on like one of my stones right now? Should I keep going? You know, stuff like that. I like to see that. Only time will tell if they actually, you know, do something like that. Also, I need to check and see do we have keys like mailbox keys all right so now the only thing we have left is shoes we're gonna get those to five as well oh yeah the bank keys so the bank keys still last a month they aren't permanent or anything 
That's still the same. That will never change. But it is a lot better for that because you gotta gotta remember that there are way larger bags inside of this game now. And with way larger bags, it's gonna be so much easier to like put a whole bunch of items. That's something a lot of like players in the official version have complained about is like you know, one character having so much so many items to the point where you have to make a mule character which is basically a character that takes all of your junk from your main character do you have to send it all the way back personally i would prefer a share bank if i was the official version i would do a share bank between those characters because you know account exclusive items account accounts exclusive items is you know, not fun because especially if you get like an item that is, you know, how do I say it? Item that you cannot trade, but you want to use on a different character. And I say it's fine that it can't be traded or can't be used if it's bound to my account, but I want to use it elsewhere, you know? Okay, defense a little bit higher. Nothing like hugely significant. Until we get into battle and see it for ourselves. Now uh, we gotta put this back on. Part of me kind of wishes that was like percentage wise, like 20%. Oh, they're still hitting me for pretty, pretty much the same. The only difference is that uh, no more gear, like the normal set gears you get from uh, Sprite will actually be better than this gear. Well, better than Legacy gear. Legacy gear is literally just for, for speed leveling. Like, don't get me wrong, it, it can be used for sure. Okay, 58 XP. Ah, shit. I, I forgot again. I was supposed to go get a potion. Buy a whole bunch of potions. Oh, I don't have enough gold to buy a whole bunch of potions anyway, do I? I think about it. Well, shoot. Let's grab that and go out and come back in. Okay, I was just checking to see if I used the other one. Um, let's see. Door. Cell. Yeah, potions are very expensive. I mean, they're also very good for selling, too. So if you, like, collected a whole stack of, like, potions, you can easily just sell them. I mean, that it's inside of the normal Grand Fantasia that potions are, like, scaled pretty high when it comes to, like, stacks. I'm about to burn through these. I'm going to set it to 20.
I actually could have made a lot of gold if I would have uh, just sold this for the 30k that the, that was told that it sells for. But to be honest, I probably wouldn't sell it for 30k. Since it doesn't really do like too much. I mean, the damage reduction is nice, the extra damage reduction. Actually, come with me. Oh, they stun. Okay. Didn't know that. Oh, whoops. Wrong button. That could have been bad. Man, if only that transformation stun wasn't like... Well, animation wasn't like extremely long. I would love to use it. Wait, Mastery System opens up at level 40... 45? I actually didn't know that. Each level mana healing. So there's something I wanted to test because I feel like it's something to this. That stone. Is this stone? Wait, what the hell? Is this stone giving us points towards our mastery? Is that what it is? Okay, no. This stone is something else. I don't know what this is. Because it doesn't give me anything here. So I was thinking it was something interesting. Oh yeah, I forgot about Tree of Life. Huh. I have no idea what the stone is. Well, either way it goes, it shouldn't be extremely difficult to, um, to bring it up. So what is this mission? Oh, this is for, um... This, this is the next uh, area we got to do. That's what it is. After a uh, cave, we got to go here. That's what that was. Okay, back to what we were doing. I just had to come out here and test that stone a little bit. I, I thought it I thought it was what I was thinking it was, but it is it is definitely not. Um Am I blind? Oh yeah. Right.
Ah, got to make sure I have a charge. I gotta say, man, those basic and abilities, like, increase, it's fantastic. But, like I said, Drew has always been, like, hoed out of a lot of mechanics like that. Just because they rely on their transformations a lot. You douche nugget. Why? Why, why do I feel like that should have stunned? <laughs> I'm pretty sure you're well in the radius of it. So without the summon, I want to see... Is it a lot better? Oh, there's a transformation for it. Oh, is it a gotcha to where you have to like, you have a chance of getting it? Because there wasn't a choice between picking through, picking one. Or at least I didn't see it. Do you have to go through a table a second time for it? If so, that kind of sucks. <laughs> oh, yeah, this is this is awful. Jesus, that that animation takes ten years. That is terrible. <laughs> it's neat, but it is so awful. I wanted to stun him before uh before this guy stunned me so I didn't get hit extra extra times.
Okay, why isn't he using it? Okay, I was about to say. That's what I was talking about. It has a weird delay on it. Don't worry, I got this. Ah, wrong seal. Ah, uh, if I say, did I run out of mana again? Yes, I did. So around this time of running low on mana, I want to immediately put up my buffs, my region. Just in case I get in the bad situation to where I cannot heal. Because I'm low on mana. There it is. It actually activated. Then it started dropping his HP like extremely fast. I'll say that's the best thing about uh this title. Is that it can start melting bosses. If you have like the the damage per second, really, that's all that really matters for that. Technically, I can just use a uh, wolf form now. But I gotta get back to being comfortable with it. That, that's really the only issue. I gotta get back to being comfortable, comfortable with um, with older druid. Gotta figure out what I want to build, what I want to get into. Um, can I bring up staff with just no? I need a stone. Okay, to bring on quest is done. And what we're gonna start doing is rushing our staff. Since we'll be inside of a human form for a while until we get to level 60, then we can switch over to wolf form.
You see, here's the issue, man. If the if the official server had like you know speed like this, I actually wouldn't even mind spending spending on a couple of AP if they had like you know level six energy pills that increase it for like that much to where it's just instant. And you also got to remember that their cooldown for these uh, things are already pretty low, even without the uh, even without the pill. Hey, yeah, you're out of energy. Hold on. Um, we're out by level 50. Ah, you're still failing. Stop. Stop failing. So yeah, here is the level 50 staff. So we're inside of the this territory. Oh, whoops. I sent him out on a freaking <laughs> Damn it. I, I was trying to send you out on that. Well, it's a little bit too late now, but you know, hey, it is what it is. But uh that is full. And you also fill out these a lot faster as well. That's another thing that's really amazing. Because you can just fill these out and get rid of the sprite like you just don't need it anymore. Uh, plus, yeah, we're going to have to get rid of the sprite soon anyway. Since it'll be level 50. Then we'll have to get our better sprites afterwards. Then there's this. Then there is this staff. This staff is actually really, really good. Wait a minute, is that an out of order or something? Double damage actually isn't that bad too. If you want to like try and get the most out of your uh, nature's wrath. 20% actually is pretty good. Surfing is fine, but it's not really all that good because you have to do normal attacks. It's good for wolf form though. If you want to use a staff with wolf form. Just get someone I like so bad. But if you want to actually like abuse the hell out of uh, Nature's Wrath. This this would be the main thing I would suggest is a uh, curse eye. So I would say immediately build that when you can honestly. Um, okay, we're going to continue on until we have enough to build that. And until we're to the level to where we can build that. I was actually just sitting there to heal some of my stuff back. Hopefully I wasn't supposed to get both of those items and it just didn't give it to me. Because if it was supposed to give me the VIP for our, for Anubis, I definitely did not get it. I'll have to talk to Hal about that one and see what's what's up with that. 
Because like I said, it would have to suck if you had to go through the table twice in order to get her. Even though it... Or if it was like a choice, it definitely didn't give me the choice of doing that. Which uh, throws me off massively. So, I'm very interested to know... Did I goof? Or did I overlook something? Hmm. I don't know. I really, uh, don't know. Because I personally, I, w I was aiming for the newest VIP transformation. Hopefully that isn't the case. Because like I said, I already hit my budget and I, I'm not going over it. Okay, so what is everything I need for this staff? So I need that. Uh... If I didn't goof up and do this... <laughs> We probably would have been done with it by now, but, you know. Well, actually, no, we wouldn't have because I would still have to go collect the pieces. Gotta remember that I'm out-leveling these dungeons. And we're not going to be, like, already there that the things that we need or want. My brain is just, you know, in overdrive, apparently. Okay, so we're about to be level 47. Also, gotta go back and get... <laughs> buy my uh, skills again. But uh, I'm not gonna be able to do that because I have no gold. I actually didn't even check clay prices, actually. I remember correctly. Uh, yeah, it was this. That was a yellow staff for us. If I can get my hands on that, I think I should be golden on damage for a while.
Especially since I'll have 100% crit. Oh yeah, you guys give misfortune, don't you? If I remember correctly. No, it's not misfortune. Ah, uh, nope, you do give misfortune. Oh god. I was say, I am still... St wait. The hell? What did go on there? Oh, wait, don't they have a um, charge increase? Isn't that what that is? Where it slows down my uh, casting speed? Let's see. Nah, that was a... But it is... It's killing my mana, though. Okay, so small groups with this one, too. Kind of got to learn, like, what groups you can do, which one's the fastest one to get to when you're doing the whole nature's wrath way. Okay, let me get some of my mana back. Okay, so these are still a thing. Aren't these transformations? No, now that I think about it, what are relationships for sprites again? Oh, yeah, that's what it is. Our PvP status. Is that PvP server, if I remember correctly? I think that is PvP server. Oh yeah, uh, it's also not how area games was when they were doing like, hey, you gotta spend those points in order to get the rewards. It's as soon as it's purchased, that goes into your um, that goes into your spender spender rewards. You don't have to spend the AP in order for it to count. Which was something that was very, very stupid for your games. Now you gotta spend exactly these points. You'll be off by like two points. Two or ten points. You gotta figure out like a way to spend those ten points or something. It was very, very dumb. I'm actually a lot, I'm actually like very happy that this game didn't go with the whole area game method of spending just to increase your spender tiers.
Wait, how much? Did they change uh, how much this is requiring? It seems like it's a little bit lower than what it usually is. From what I've seen so far. You also maximize the time of your potions if you just delay it a little bit. If you want to, like, keep track of it. It's normally one, two, three. Then I would charge again. One, two, three. One, two, three. Three. Because as soon as I hit that three off my like fast charge, I say that that's pretty much when they uh when they come back up. You pretty much start counting right after you're done charging. But that was that's like more of the like mid maxing side, if you're interested in that. But yeah, that's all I got for uh, just 100 and killing that group of enemies. Stop that. Oh god, really? You just did... Still did it, you douche. <laughs> I mean, right now I'm getting like 72 XP. Ah, oh my god, I ran out of mana again. God, I hate Misfortune. Misfortune is such an annoying ability. Or debuff. Ah, I could have swapped into it. I actually could have saved that. But I was still low on mana. If I didn't get hit by Misfortune, I actually would have been fine. Ah, there it is again. Now I gotta play... Get old game to get it off. Stun him again. There we go. I say I started spamming my shining judgment just to just to try and get that quick charge to be able to stun them again. It's a lot better than just, you know, relying on purifying or curse killer. To get rid of like certain debuffs. Just kind of like you got, you just gotta brute force it sometimes. And just hope for the best. <laughs> Because Judgment is a lot cheaper by four points for uh, your cleanses. I 
Okay, so I am almost level 50. That's great. I wish this would come back right now. <laughs> so I don't feel like I goofed anymore, you know? Oh, you guys are actually just the lone little party out here, huh? Uh, but, but I was about to say, just for $100, just to be able to get everything on the um, reward list this is actually not bad. I mean, you're still a well at that point, but you're not like, you know, as bad as other games when it comes to welling. Especially not as bad as mobile games and gotchas, you know? That, that's the real kicker there. Oh, got it. Wasn't this a demon? What the hell did he have? I don't remember. Wait, what? Oh god, did I not do, do this guy's quest? <laughs> Duh. Dummy. I gotta go redo that. <laughs> Darn it. I mean, that's fine. Thought I gotta go redo it. I said I wasn't like too far in there. Plus, I got, like I said, I gotta go get my other skills. And I'm waiting for this guy to come back as well. Uh, I think my other skills are actually be on my price range, actually, for gold wise. Yeah, a lot of my skills are out of price range. Except for this. I will always grab that. And that. Everything else is pretty much not really all that needed. Except for render. I'll always take that as well and that's about all I can get sucks but you know what that that's that's the draw I guess I can go to auction and see what um what items are available That's how I use this for movement speed and transform back when I'm in a boss. Yeah, I kind of wanted to see. Is that... Okay, so yeah, that guy has... The pet one too. I haven't seen anybody with the transformation yet. Which is interesting.
Because I was thinking that somebody would have the transformation by now, but no, I haven't seen a single person with it. So I, is it is it bugged? That's the real question. Is it is it bugged? Okay, so nucleus in there. Okay, so that's uh, pet stuff. Not pet stuff, sprite stuff. Oh, that's one thing I haven't checked. Um, runestones. Okay, runestone stones aren't like very significant right now. Thing is, I don't think anybody else is going through the table again. Just because they think it might be bugged right now. I wonder if it's bugged, will they give out everybody their stuff individually? I wonder. I see some graphic bugs, though. There you are. Hey, buddy. Welcome back. Just, just want to test some things, you know. Ah, there we go. Just wanted to see if I can get that nice stuff without it. What does it go down to? Okay. That's why we could put one in. Wait, what? Oh, it didn't change. All right, so let's go back to the dungeon now. Uh, we'll have to reset it. I think we should be good. Uh, where the hell is it? I'm blind again. Where the fuck is it? There it is. I, I have no idea what you just whispered to me. <laughs> if that is hello, then hello back to you. <laughs> um. Okay, so yeah, we gotta go all the way around. Uh, we gotta go back through this direction again. Oh, you dick. Don't be a dick, dude. I'd say, damn, that stun lasts for a while, doesn't it?
How did I not claim it? Okay, so everything that I'm missing right now, okay, I'm missing the roots. Rub my eye right quick. Okay. Okay, so we got all that. We can build this part of the staff. Okay, we can't build that yet. Gotta get gold. I kind of do want to play around with the um, with the items though. Like I say, like I said, they're neat. It's just difficult for me as a druid to use them. So I'm gonna be using wolf form for this. Put on this, and we're gonna. Just use her a little bit. Actually, I could be using um Gorilla Form, actually. This hit before would actually be a lot more a lot more usable. Now what was it? Was this No, that's magic. Yeah, there it is. Ten percent defense. And if I go into Gorilla Form and put on my actual abilities.
Funny enough, I should be having this on. Because like I said, this is better than the mana right now. first let me heal let me put on my region there we go Wait, why does that feel a lot faster? Oh, at least I thought it was a lot faster. It is not. Does that drain mana to me or? No, it doesn't drain mana to me. They're down there fighting her. <laughs> That's funny. I can't hit him. There we go. I mean, at least she's good for distracting, to be honest. That's the one thing that I I hope that the official server does is make pets useful. Like those little summoning pets from like the crystals, like um. These, these magic stones, that's what I was kind of hoping that they would make like ye very useful. Because that would actually be like really cool if these things actually had like an actual function. Kind of sucks that this game also doesn't, <laughs> this game doesn't think that it should have a function like that. So I'm kind of sad about that, you know. I thought it would have been the idea. I'm going to message Hal after this and see uh, is the table bugged or what's going on with the whole Anubis thing.
Because I'm kind of curious about what's going on there. Um, um, oh, what the fuck, game? <laughs> I wasn't even trying to aggro them. I was just trying to look at my potions and see where I was at. What the hell, man? I'm actually gonna kind of curious of where uh that our potions are. I say I haven't seen like the mana HP potions yet. Wonder if they've been on table already and they won't be back for a while. Well, I am officially out of HP. Like I said, grill form great for uh, great for tanking. It's just that you're definitely gonna need potions. <laughs> For those of you guys who are interested in learning Druid, you're learning that Druid is very, very, very resource heavy. Very fun class, though. All right, let's see if I can get in touch with Hal and see what's going on with uh, Anubis. Let's see, what was the name of them? Because I'm curious about this. Because her face is also where this guy is on the table, as you guys saw when I showed it. I wonder if there's anything in the, in the uh, 
Discord about it. Hmm. Nah, nobody said anything about the Anubis. Interesting. Okay, well... I don't know. I, I messaged, uh... How? Just to see if they know anything about it. Out of curiosity. Because maybe they would know more. Ah, oh, they got in the battle where. God, I can't wait to get my actual, like, damage hammers. But the be honest, I think the only reason I feel like damage is off is because um, you can only go with the plus nine. Which shouldn't be like an issue or anything. I believe I'm just overthinking it. Plus, I'm not using like um, an actual set. I'm using a legacy, so that's also a thing as well. I said, just making sure I haven't, like, you know, totally overlooked anything. Which I don't think I did. Okay, so now, since I'm over le almost level 50, um, oh, we got gold again. Dungeon is actually, like, really good for gold. Jesus. The reason I say that is because I say we've only been killing monsters inside Dungeon. We haven't been turning in quests or anything. It has actually been giving us a very decent amount of silver to where we're just, just passively getting gold. So that means upper dungeons are going to be really easy for getting gold. Which is something I like to see. You know, it gives you a reason to run dungeons. Dungeons exist. And there's level 50. So now we need Shiva, who is down that way. So I gotta basically retrace my steps.
So back to making a staff. Oh god, I got stuck. So what I'm gonna need you to do is grab more stuff that we need. They give us the level three. And I still need blood. But what we can make is this as a placeholder. And we can also make this as a placeholder too. I feel like making this as a placeholder first would be a lot more beneficial until we can actually get this. So dimension gate will be made right away. This also helps with fame as well. Now that I think about it. Because you'd be getting scrolls left and right. Well, that was that. Okay. Where is... Then once we make that, we just got to sit here. And then we got to go back to... What was it? We got to go all the way back to... Perry Cave and get our stuff there. But this is going to help us with damage, if anything. At least until we get that staff done. And get the extra bonuses. Uh, oh, shit. Blessed. Okay, nice, nice, nice. Always like the bless. Uh, where is it? There it is. Let's see if we can get it to six. Without it getting like too low, at least. Oh God, hiccups, Jesus, my soul. Oof, okay. Game was like, dude, no, use it now. <laughs> okay. So now we have Dimension Gate. Curiosity. Okay, nope. I had to check, you know. You you never know if they could have done that. Oh, it's supposed to be going this way. Still moving.
Okay, some things are going to be triggering it. Some things won't. I say this is fine because all we're losing is cast speed and a little bit of crit. This is just going to have to, you know, do at least until we can actually get first eye. And that will probably be in the next dungeon. Ooh, which I hope I don't out level actually. Oh, also, now that I look at that staff, this is actually decent to carry and use in my wolf form. As long as I'm getting a group like this, shouldn't really matter either. Another thing I can do. There you go. <laughs> Keep forgetting I can just swap back and forth. That's what that staff is going to be really good for. So, the eye staff you never really are going to get rid of. It is always going to be your main bread and butter for a long time in human form. Guess I should change to mana form right now. Guess how my mana back. Does that evolve into anything good? Because I'm if I remember correctly, it evolves and gives me mana, right? Oh god, stop. Oh, no, they changed it. Or I, I thought they changed it. This one gives your group... Wait, what? Okay, so... Oh, okay, I see, I see. I'm thinking about level 100 stuff. This stuff doesn't matter at all. This is, this is Garbanzo. This doesn't matter. This is the new class stuff right here. I am overlooking everything, apparently. I say they do have, like, new stuff. Not everything is new. Okay, some things haven't been touched at all. 
Some things have been touched. Some things haven't. I don't think that's available to us. I think these are both uh, non-existent. So that explains why this is the symbol for this, and it goes back to this. Oh yeah, and the radius increases for this once it evolves. Huh. I was not looking at that. Now it just makes me like very, very curious. Considering Druid itself, the last class does not exist. Which means I lose out on my shield, right? Yeah, I'm, I miss out on a shield of eternity for a while. And today I actually like figure out what they want to do. Damn. Because that, that's actually funny, because that was what I was actually aiming for, was Shield of Eternity. <laughs> well, that sucks, man. I actually love Shield of Eternity. So, considering you changed this, like... Icon wise, makes me curious if it has any other properties other than just healing more. Because what most druids wanted Tree of Life to also do was cleanse, since it was the Tree of Life. <laughs> I mean, that's what a lot of us wanted since, yeah, like I said, it was the Tree of Life. We wanted it to also cleanse, but I don't think that's going to be a thing, which is also going to be very interesting to see where all of this leads. sure if you're aggro kind of me I don't trust that aggro range especially since it's been changed quite a bit you just fight with us for a while sorry dude I'm not physical exhaust doesn't work on me
Like I said, wolf form with the staff is actually not half bad. But at level 66, like I said, is where we shine just because rendering rendering Fang gets life still. Hello? Oh my god. I forgot it has heal cancel. It will give me a little bit more damage reduction. Yeah, I'm just going to keep picking you in your chest. It's kind of weird, though, but the way they have it set up for it to start out with the basic thing it did inside the official version, then at level 90, it then changes. That's kind of strange. I think I'm out of mana officially, right? Yeah. Damn. I wish I can get rid of the aggro. I have no heals or anything. Oh wait, no, I had I do have a heal. Didn't even realize. I could have been using that this whole time. Oof, man. Oof. Damn, dude. The potion hungriness of Druid. We're just gonna stop right there, though. Uh, mostly what I wanted to do was have fun with a little bit of these uh, items. Uh, I guess next video we'll know what is up with the whole VIP thing for Anubis. When it seems like we should have it, but we don't. I guess I'll just try and re-log again. Like, just log out and jump back on the character. Because that usually works. They usually pop up inside of the mailbox. If it doesn't, then hey, I guess we'll just... Figure, figure out something else. Nope, nothing in there. Well then, that's some forge. Uh, it bees like that. Anywho, that kind of throws me off from uh <laughs> from um spending spending table for a while. I say that that was the number one thing I wanted out of that spending table. It's kind of weird that the image would be there and talk about like you know. The PVE stuff. So uh, I, we'll see. We'll see what happens uh, next video. Either way it goes, I'm still going to give this the full try. And we'll 
get it all done. With that said, I'll see you guys in the next one. Until then, peace out.